This bag, I don't need repair since last three weeks now. The bag never do. Wait till I go do like this. Since last three weeks, I don't know what's wrong with this bag. I, I, I've been trying it, trying it. I, it's not working. What's happening? Oh my God, Father, help me. Ah, 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 ah. ah good afternoon, Mao. Good, good afternoon. afternoon sir. Good afternoon. How is everything? What is wrong with you? Now, this is my bag. Oh. Since last three weeks, I don't know what to do. Oh. Just ah. they give me a while. Oh. I've been calling me. Ah, check out. Okay. This is my work now. Don't worry. I will help you. Eh, I play. We we'll do them together, Jari. Ah. I don't try like this, try like this, but you know the. Close it, close it, do it again. Ma? Close it. We should close it. Eh, close okay, it. okay. Ah. Close it. Ah, you know what you do. Ah. Hello, good afternoon. How are you doing? What, what are you people doing? It's this bag. Oh, she just came to, she's helping me to repair the bag, ma. I don't even know. Come on, sit down, do sit down. Ah, please, let's do it. Oh. Let me do it. Oh. God bless you, Jesus' name. Oh. Ah. Please, ah, let, do it like this. Okay, no, okay. Do it like that. let's do it like this. Should we do it like this? Yeah, yeah. yeah it will work. It will work. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hi, it's everything. Why is happening here? It's giving me a problem. I don't know. They are helping me out. I don't know. Let's try together, all of us. Let's see what we can do. Okay. Why not do it this way? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. We should do it this way. Yes. Like this. Let's try it. Let's try it. Yeah. Ah, it didn't work, oh. Like this? Yeah, like, like, take it like yeah, this, take it like this. Like this. Oh my God, it's working, oh. Wow, wow. Wow. The, wow. Ah, ah. Since three weeks ago, see me, oh. see me, see me, see ah. Praise the Lord. Our short playlets were just trying to reflect what unity is all about. When there's unity, it produces results. As workers, as workers in the house of God, we need unity in all we do. We need cooperation. It's out of unity. That's why we are gathered today. Remember less. United we stand. United we stand. What did they do, your friend? No, no. She, she's always moody. Always moody. People are too much this day. <coughs> oh, wow. What did they do now? Well, Maybe not because she just seen you walk. Oh, Ashakara too much. <coughs> Allah, wow. Allah, too much self. Even if you quit her, she will not answer. answer. She is too moody. Mm -mm. Why is that for you? Wow. Eh? No, make sure you not go slap me. I know if it's Praise the Lord, man. Are you okay, man? I saw your mood. I just came to ask you if all is well with you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, church. Our topic is mindset. We should endeavor, you know, if we see our colleagues, our friends, in any sad situation, let's not be talking about them, maybe, you know, gossiping them. Let's, en let's endeavor to come to them, to know what's wrong with them, you know. You know, be like a comforter to them, you know, instead of by backing, you know. When you talk to them, it can go a long way to suit their pains. Praise the Lord. So I encourage all of us, whenever we see our, our members, our friends, whoever, let's not go there and be talking wrong about them, but let's endeavor to reach out to them in our words of otherwise. Praise the Lord. Oh, wow. You know, see, that brother, eh? I don't know his problem. He can never polish his shoe for once. Ever since he has, he is married now, eh? To polish shoe is wala. Me, I don't know what he's thinking, no. Maybe he's too big now. I don't know. Maybe, maybe he now he's, you know, he has arrived. So he can only get polish shoe. I don't just know his problem. But this kingdom work, eh? You know, say, we need to keep polishing our shoe. If we don't polish our shoe, there's no way her that. I don't even know what is wrong with your sister. You know that she likes to think that see me, she's holy. She's here, you know, so she can she can pretend. Ah! Stanley, Abby, you know, see what we they talk. We have to think about the work of God and not talk about our, our brothers and sisters in the church. So we are doing our proko. You are doing our mobile. Okay. <laughs> Why do you ask her? I told you. 
She ah, she savvy past everything for this church. Before you know, que, que, and it's a lie. She can't pretend. Mm. Oh, wow. It's no good to talk about your brothers. If anything, tell him that brother, you're supposed to polish your shoe and he will hear you and he will do it. Are you sure if we meet him, he will accept? Yes. Okay. So do, what do we do now? You go, you call him, or if you are a woman, you cannot tell one of the brothers to call him, say, brother, polish your shoes when you are coming to church so that you would look neat. And he will ask, he will And I that. have an idea. You can equally buy a polish, mm -hmm. you know, and you wrap it well, mm -hmm. you can present to him. Mm -hmm. By the time you give him, he knows that. Definitely have not been polished in my shoe. Oh, Praise oh, the Lord. Hallelujah. <laughs> Amen. All we want to say is that when you see something about your brother or sister, find a way to talk to them than to gossip about it. Amen. Praise the Lord. We have a short plate leg. The title is called Unforgiveness. Unforgiveness. This is Brother Christian. He's a worker in the church of God. Is a media, a chorister, and a prayer band, of, you know, and all shall very effective in the house of God. But there is an issue in his life. See that chain that tie his hand down. It is this chain of unforgiveness. He said his pastor has offended him. The church members step on his toes, and he's still praying for God's blessing. See how he's praying. He's praying for God's blessings. Look at the angel. The angel of God is bringing blessing to him. But he couldn't stretch forth his hand because of that chain of unforgiveness that have bounded him down. Only if you can pray, my brother. If only you can take away that the spirit of unforgiveness. Only if you can walk in, or if you can walk in forgiveness. Only if you can ask for forgiveness. Only if you can do that. Only if you can do that, you can stretch down your hands. You see, my brother is ready. The angel of God has come. He's coming. Hallelujah. He's losing that chain of unforgiveness so that he can attain his blessings. Hallelujah. The freedom is here. Hallelujah. This is the gift. He has collected the gift because the spirit of unforgiveness has taken his heart away. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. It's to encourage us as children of God. Unforgiveness is a chain that bound one. As he is praying, the angel is stretching for the goodness to take. But because of that spirit of unforgiveness, it doesn't matter who you are. It might be a worker, a minister, a pastor. If only we can walk in forgiveness. God bless us in Jesus' name. We, the group five, we just want to praise God in our own way. In two um, minutes, please. We pray that as you listen, God bless you in Jesus' name. Why won't we give praise unto God? Why won't we worship this God? By the way, which God are we talking about? The God of heaven? The maker of heaven and the earth? He's our maker. He's our healer. He's the one who sits in heaven and make the earth the first two. By the way, he made the earth his first two. And yet still contained in the heart of men. How wonderful. How awesome. How mighty. How excellent is this God. This God is so awesome. What we say, what he says, he will do. And what he does, nobody can question him. Wait. I say he is a provider. Has he ever provided for you? 
Yes, he has provided for me. He has made a way where there seems to be no way. Even those days that I think things will not work out. He came around me, embracing me with his warm embrace. And he put a smile on my face. That is why I say, Oh yeah, Kadu Ben. Oh yeah, Kadu Ben. Oh yeah, Kadu Ben. A ransom. Why not put down this load? You have been carrying all this load all this while. Where has it gotten you to? Why not lay it at the feet of Jesus? I can't be there anywhere. My cousin is there. My dear one is there. No papa, no mama, no only me. They take care of there. I can't put away to my first step. They look towards up. I can't keep it away. I have to carry them along though. I have to carry them along. I have to help them. All my dear ones, my family, they are out there. I can't keep it away. This is too much for you. For how long will you continue like this? Jesus is the carrier of everybody. Lay it at his feet. Good and you'll morning, be free. Brothers. Look at you. Good morning, Look brothers, in this area. Are. I bring you greetings from the Lord Jesus this morning. I bring you greetings from the Calvary. From the book of Matthew chapter 11 verse 28. Jesus said, come unto me all ye that are heavy loaded. And I will give you rest. He said, take my yoke for my yoke is easy. I don't know the yoke that you may be carrying this money. Is it the yoke of your family members? Is it the yoke of, of, of pain? Is it the yoke of shame? I want you to drop it at the feet of Jesus this morning. Jesus is calling you. Jesus is calling you this morning. He said, take my yoke and my, because my yoke is easy. He's calling you this morning. He's calling you this morning. If you are in your house or you are passing by, if you are hearing me, yeah, drop your, now, your Lord on the feet of Jesus. Now we attend to them now. They will not give them somebody anything. You just... I'm tired of all these people. They just be distracting. Come, he's come. calling you. He's calling you. Drop your My yoke brother. upon him. He How will carry it. How long will you resist? He's saying his yoke How is easy. How long will you do this? He's easy. He's Why easy. Why not lay it down he's for Jesus? He's able to do all you. that you Look can imagine. You. He is able. Why not hear to the voice Drop of your Jesus. yoke onto the Calvary. Hear to that voice. Drop your yoke that onto alone Jesus. Can give you rest. Because My him brother. alone is happy. My brother. Come unto Do Jesus. Things. Come unto Jesus. Wait, oh, he I'm will give for, you rest. I'm Hallelujah. relieved already. Oh. Why is all these burdens all these days? I'm relieved already. Why all this? Ah. I thank God that I hear to this uh, woman voice. Oh. I'm relieved already. Why all this load now? Why am I disturbing myself all these days? Glory be to God. Oh. I thank this Jesus. Oh. So the, the Jesus yoke is very light. Then why am I carrying my own, what is not even belong to me? I will just the excess luggage every day and night. Glory be to Almighty God. Oh, Tisha for me, oh, Tisha for me, oh, Tisha for me, oh, Tisha. What my papa cannot solve, oh, Tisha. What my mama cannot do, oh, Tisha for me. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Our short drama, you can see it. We are here to tell you that whatever yoke you are carrying, Jesus is able to carry your yoke. He say in his word, he say, come unto me, all ye that are labor and heavy laden. He say, I will give you rest. He say, his yoke is easy. When you drop your yoke onto his feet, you will have rest. Be blessed in Jesus' name.